In this video, I'm going to teach you how to use a PlayStation 5 DualSense controller on Xbox Game Pass PC. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I'm going to teach you how you can easily set up a DualSense controller to work with any games available on Xbox Game Pass. As an example, I'm running Among Us and I'm playing with a controller. So most games will have native controller support. I just want to make that very clear, even for DualShock and DualSense controllers. So I would recommend that you try and open any game that you want to play available on the Game Pass and try using your controller. Now, assuming that it didn't work or you haven't tried already and after you do, you notice that it doesn't work, then you can do the method that I'm going to show you in this video to bypass this limitation. All that you have to do is download this tool called DS4 Windows and also DS5 Windows. As the name suggests, this is going to make it so DualSense and DualShock controllers are compatible with Windows PCs. Because Windows offers full controller support for Xbox controllers only, sometimes using a DualSense or DualShock will give you trouble inside of most games. So this tool circumvents this problem by making sure that your controller gets detected as an Xbox controller. Essentially, it is tricking any game or application that requires the controller. Now, just go over to download after you go to ds4-windows.com and then select download once more. You will download the zip file and you have to extract it somewhere. So, once you have it extracted, this is what it looks like. You will find a bunch of things here, but all that you have to do is look for this executable, ds4windows.exe. Once you run this, this window will open, where you can connect your controller and set up a profile. Now, unfortunately, I don't have a DualSense controller to demonstrate this process. I apologize, but I'm still going to be able to show you what you have to do. Here, you will be able to click Start, and you might be required to download this additional driver here, VGM Bus. So download this driver if you get the prompt. I think I already have it installed, but for some reason it's not going getting detected, and all that you have to do after is click start. Like I said, your controller will be detected here if it has been connected to your PC over a cable or wirelessly, and afterwards you can set up a profile, but usually this default one that they offer is going to be enough. You can change this profile and modify every single attachment here, but like I said, this isn't necessary. This tool is only helping us circumvent the issue of DualSense and DualShock controllers not getting detected by most Game Pass games. So as long as you keep it open on the background, you will be good to go to play any game available on Game Pass using your controller. I hope I was able to help you on how to use a PlayStation 5 DualSense controller on Xbox Game Pass PC. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.